At the Shrine of Martyr Nicholas Bonker, the Pope met with the bishops of the country. There are fewer than 20, even after being accompanied by other Asian bishops and cardinals, such as Oswald Gracias from India. The Archbishop of Bangkok greeted him on behalf of all the prelates of the country, but also on behalf of the whole Federation of Asian Bishops' Conferences. He said the Pope's visit is a great reason for celebration. I welcome you to Thailand. We are honored by your presence among us here. Pope Francis reflected about Catholic situations in places such as Thailand, where they are the minority. He encouraged them to recover the spirit of the first missionaries who evangelized in those lands and gave them this advice. Me gusta señalar que la misión, antes que las actividades para realizar o proyectos para implementar, requiere una mirada y un olfato a cultivar. Requiere una preocupación paternal y maternal porque la oveja se pierde cuando el pastor la da por perdida. Nunca antes. He also reminded them that the lady is in the most direct contact with the local people and for this reason they must be protagonists in evangelization. No perdamos de vista que muchas de vuestras tierras fueron evangelizadas por laicos. No clericalicemos la misión, por favor. Y mucho menos clericalicemos los laicos. At the end, Pope Francis also advised them not to be carried away by discouragement or apathy. He said these are allies of the devil. To wrap up the meeting, he asked them to pray so he could put everything he said into practice, then greeted each of the bishops one by one. Rome Reports is now available on your TV. Thanks to our new app, Rome Reports Premium, you can watch exclusive content, documentaries, special reports, analysis, and more. You'll be able to access Rome's most recent news, now in HD and without commercials. Download the Rome Reports app in English or in Spanish. It's available on Apple TV, Roku, Amazon Fire, and Android TV.